and we're live. We're live. Okay. Excellent. <laughs> okay. Say hi to Jerome. Hi, hi Jerome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, friends. <sighs> Welcome. Thank you for taking time for yourself, whether it's live here with me right now, or maybe you stumble across this later today or at some other point when it was just meant to be, to take a seat, to take some time for yourself, to linger, to breathe, and to take a practice that can be whatever you need it to be, right? This morning, um, if, it's, if it's live for you, it's Friday, at least for me, it's Friday at the moment. And I was anticipating rain all day today. And so when I woke up and it wasn't raining, I was delighted. And I managed to like get myself up a bit earlier so I could go out for an early walk before my day started. And I consider that part of my mindfulness practice, something to the level of meditation and absolutely self-care. Okay. So if what you have for yourself here right now is the practice just to sit and linger and breathe and let that be some space for yourself as mindfulness and or self-care, beautiful. And so I was out for my walk, I think because we had a lot of weird weather the last few days, I was super aware of like the sky was this brilliant, like cerulean blue, and the clouds were puffy. It was really, really lovely. Um, and while I was out, there was you know a variety of the owl that's in the neighborhood next to me who was having a chat. And it was just really nice to be immersed in an environment and to be tuned in to what's around me versus being caught up with what's in here, right? Um, and that's its own challenge. And I'm not saying don't parse through what is in your mind, um, because maybe that's something that you do, but maybe today we can visualize our mind as that cerulean blue sky, right? Just a vibrant blue. The thoughts can be many, or few, depending on the day. But maybe we visualize the thoughts as those clouds, okay? And so the clouds can be very cluttered and dark. They can be spread out and white and puffy. And so we find space in between those thoughts, the space between the clouds, we can find that brilliant blue sky. Okay. So I'll guide a bit of breath and visualization and we'll linger. You just see how it goes because it's a practice. It does not have to be perfect because life isn't perfect. Arranging your seat in a way that is comfortable for you. If you're feeling adventurous, you can cross your legs the weird way. It took me about, I don't know, 18 months or so a while back. I don't naturally sit with my left leg in front, but it no longer feels super strange. Okay, so you don't have to sit on the floor. You can grab a chair. Um, you can sit on the stool or sit on the couch, but do have a nice tall spine. Shoulders stacked over hips. Maybe even inhale the shoulders up. It's one of my favorite things to do. Exhale them back and down, just as a reminder. Once you've found your seat, wherever it might be, let the gaze be soft to the floor. Or invite the eyes to close. Hands land in a place that is comfortable. Breathe in. Breathe out. And take a few rounds of your own breath, whatever that might be. As you settle in here to your seat, just take a moment to notice what your breath feels like. Does it feel smooth or choppy, elongated or short? And not in a judgy way, more in a, hmm, that's interesting. Just a little assessment, curiosity about how you feel. And tune in here to how your body feels. Maybe you 
notice any places of tension, anything that might be holding on. I sometimes literally like rub the space between my eyebrows and ignore my forehead. The other thing you can do is take your tongue and run it in between your teeth and the outside of your mouth. It feels funny and it releases the jaw. Take a moment to check in with your mind. No need to change anything. Just notice whatever there is to notice. that assessment, that awareness, and just setting it off to your side. And draw your awareness now down to your feet and your legs and your bum. And feel the places on your body that meet the earth. this grounded, mindful seat. The awareness floats back up to your torso. And here, notice movement that comes with the inhale. movement that follows the exhale. At the top of your inhale, Find that moment where everything pauses. And the exhale pours out. The bottom of your exhale, a similar moment. And then you draw the breath in. Continue to linger here in your grounded, mindful seat, following these four parts of your breath. The inhale. The retention. The exhale. And the suspension. If that feels good, continue to follow your breath as the point of focus. Or simply allow yourself to breathe here and in your mind's eye, picture a brilliant blue sky. Your favorite color blue. In the sky, a smattering of clouds. Are they wispy 
or puffy. Do they look like a mosaic where there's little clouds and then the cracks between them? here in this brilliant blue sky, you, your mind, as a cloud floats by, it doesn't have to stay. You can invite it just to float right on by. And a thought pops up, it doesn't have to stay. Let it float right on by. And just like we were gazing at the clouds, you just identify your thoughts as exactly what they are. That's a thought. That's an idea. That's a to-do. And let them float right by. Just set them off to the side. There'll be time later. And for now, I invite you to linger here in your grounded, mindful seat. Either listen to your breath and or gaze upon your brilliant blue sky.
as you continue to breathe here. You're visualizing your sky. Perhaps you've been carried off by the clouds. Well, there's just so many clouds and there's even more dark and thick covering the sky. Imagine them floating right by, creating space between you and them. Can you find the space between your thoughts? Slivers of blue. As you breathe here in your grounded, mindful sleep. Please know that you have found that flow and you can linger for as long as you'd like. And begin to gently blink your eyes open. Perhaps inviting any movement in the shoulders and the neck that would feel good after finding the stillness. Oh. 
palms come together, Anjali Mudra, the Mudra of offering. Thumbs rest upon heart center. Offering yourself gratitude for finding this time for whatever practice you explore. Thanking your breath for supporting you and guiding the way. And thanking your body for being so patient and resilient and lingering in your seat. Thumbs find third eye point, your seat of intuition. I thank you for sharing your time, your energy and your beautiful practice with me. Until our paths cross again, my friend, be well and namaste. Thank you. And feel free to reach out if you have any questions. Have a wonderful rest of your day.